This is Jotunheim. As beautiful as the stories. And then some. I'm sure I know. Here, Finn. Mm. Kratos, Vimir, Freya, it's good to see you. I wish to thank you for creating a path out of Asgard for us. Aye, a true pleasure to meet the lassie who saved our skins. Indeed. Your giant stuff magic is truly a marvel. We were so glad we got there in time. Freya, your brother's sacrifice won't be forgotten. It won't. I will say, you've made quite the impression on our Atreus's heart. Well, there. Oh, like you weren't thinking it, brother. Ahem. You're a cherished ally, Angraboda. I hope we cross paths again. <laughs> I imagine we will. There's lots to do, and I'm just getting started. Man, this forward. Good old boy. Good boy. Kratos, the last time you were here was because of Faye, right? You saw this in prophecy. Your son told me. It's a beautiful place to rest. It is what she wished. You painted these shrines. Some of them. Some I finished for my mother. Your work is beautiful. Your skill with a brush is unmatched, Angerboda. My son. He draws. He told me. Although he'd do well to learn from your use of color. We come from a long line of artisans, so he has it in him. He just needs some discipline to bring it out. <laughs> I like you. And this gold burden. giant left in your name no actually my grandmother Gryla. she's um not really one for visitors but she's still here she's helping me forage at the moment after all you've done lass she must be so proud to have a granddaughter such as yourself she she might be someday i don't know quite yet but i think it's a start Incredible. 
by one I mean discovered Bigyan na dahil sa bahay niya. Memories. We're heading back to Charlie? Yes. He's not going to be very happy with me. No. <clears throat> Charlie. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was... I have no excuse for neglecting you. I will do my best to earn it. Is someone inside? Yes. Warming up already, isn't it? Berger. Hello. What are you doing here? Keeping warm. Both of us. It is your home if you wish me to leave. No. It's good that he has someone. Will you stay? There is still much to be done. Then we will wait. And when it is time to rest, I will keep the hearth warm. Thank you, Berger. Need to see Berger, brother. Freya, the flower. To Vanaheim, then. Sounded like Lady Sif managed to convince the old boar to shelter the Aesir refugees. It was his idea. Oh? To foster peace among the Vanir and Aesir. That's brilliant. Shifty bastard must be trying to prove he can out diplomat me. At least he's not convincing her to marry someone. <laughs> A deservedly low blow, Your Majesty. <laughs> You don't have a body near me. Also, my flower seed.
Warte mal, belegt. You know, back in Jotunheim, I had half a mind to ask Angerboda what exactly her intentions were with the lad. One look at her and any doubts I had melted away. <laughs> it's a question every parent must grapple with sooner or later. I trusted her with my life. I trust her with my son. You can't argue with that. Information I would need daddy. Brother, I've heard my share of stories about your homeland, but I've also heard that you once fought in a tournament. I fought in many contests. But this particular one, I heard you did battle with beasts, scoundrels, princesses, the undead, automatons, and history's greatest musician. That's not... that's not true, is it? I would not speak of this. Fair enough, brother. <laughs> Behind you, Kratos! 
to giving the realms a shot at you. Well, seems like a good time to get back to that story you asked for, brother. Set that aside for now. Come. Brother, I never got the chance to tell you. 
I know moments like this you're supposed to say sorry and whatnot, but I always known that pretty, pretty man had greatness in him. That he'd do something amazing one day, and I'm just, you know, I'm proud that now the Nine Realms know it too. I, I thank you. Anytime, ma'am. Kratos, Freya, welcome back. Come here. Lady Seth, Freya, it speaks volumes seeing you here in person. The first of the Aesir to visit us in peace. Really, your majesty? It's the capacity of the Vanir's forgiveness that speaks volumes. We know Asgard was more than Odin and his Aenir Yar. If they'll help us rebuild, they're more than welcome to stay. Aesir and Vanir living together. I never thought it possible. I imagine a severe lack of options for the Aesir helped ease things along. Oh, Mimir. It has truly been a pleasure not listening to your prattling commentary for the last hundred winters. Well, excuse me, milady. A hundred winters of Mimir bleating at court? I think I'd rather be exiled. Indeed. Oh, the stories I have. Really? Do tell. Well, everything appears to be in order here, diplomacy administered, and all's well. Let's leave these two to the planning, shall we? Back to it, then. Where can we set up the farm and the granaries? here. The other side. Seems for every camp we destroy, we find two more. It's almost impressive. Alright, 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 alright. 